Thank you, President. The current um, recession slump in steel is largely because of reduced demand of uh, customers in um, car makers, particularly in the south of Europe, with their debts. And fluctuating uh, raw material prices, of course, that's an extra difficulty to contend with. And this has now affected the scrap sector as well. In the, e in the EU, we've got high production costs and we've got ruthless global competition from outside as well. And they're the ones who do not have the high energy, environmental and CO2 allowance costs. And cheap steel from third countries is finding its way onto EU markets. And they're the ones who do not have the high environmental standards. In the Commission's plans, uh, with the uh, CO2 uh, credits, we must make sure that all of those different parts of the equ equation are, are factored in. We've, if we're told that one quarter of our capacity must be closed, then let's realise that we've also got to adjust to long-term demand. And we're talking about 100,000 jobs. That's a quarter of the current workforce. If that happens, then let's not kid ourselves. The EU is going to have to um, pay out a great deal of aid in order to mitigate the, the costs uh, of job losses on that scale.